we had the most gorgeous cloud configurations with light streaming down. It's almost as if you could have imagined a host of angels coming down out of the clouds. And yet, we're trying to imagine conducting warfare on this beautiful, beautiful paradise setting. While on Guadalcanal, the team discovered that some of their designs had to be revised to match the actual scenery, including the placement of Pistol Pete. We were visiting this field that they had littered hunks of airplanes and tanks and all the stuff that had been scattered around they kind of put in one mini field in the jungle. And while we were there looking around, we looked off in the distance and there was this nice rolling green hill and Chris Cross, the lead designer of the game, he pulled me aside and said, well, okay, right there, that's Pistol Pete, that hill. And our initial concepts and initial storyboarding of that level, it had shown the Pistol Pete Mountains as being very rocky, not very much vegetation on it whatsoever, and it turns out that that doesn't exist in Guadalcanal. So that right there is a one-to-one -one comparison of what's going in the game. One of the main goals of Medal of Honor Rising Sun is to find Yamashita's gold. And in Singapore, the player will need to use stealth to find crucial information leading to its capture. We turned and looked to the side at the gutter system they had there. And, you know, it was destroyed and it had a, a unique feel to what you would imagine with a gutter system. And Chris and I just started talking. We're like, hey, you know, that would be really cool to incorporate into the game, of like a stealth area or some place you had to sneak into or hide in. I actually told Dan, our historical advisor, hey, go jump in that. I want to get reference for how low you can go. Can you crawl through it? You know, how far can we go around in this thing? And instantly sparked. Okay, that's a great stealth point. And we had civilians just walking by and just looking at it, just thinking, what a bunch of idiots crawling around in our sewer system, you know? But we definitely did revise some of our gameplay based off of what we saw there.